Hello guys, welcome to my channel. For today's video, we will review this 2024 Toyota Wigo J variant manual transmission. Alright, Toyota Motor Philippines offers the, the Toyota Wigo, an entry-level hatchback designed for young professionals living in cities or those purchasing their first vehicle. The Toyota Wigo radiates joy and excitement from every aspect, giving its aggressive front fascia, rear spoiler, and third brake light. The Wigo holds the title as one of the country's best-selling vehicle year after year. So for this J variant, wala tayong nakikita dito ng um, uh, rear spoiler and uh, this is actually the silver color and the manual transmission variant which I believe this is the the, the base model of Wigo. So makita natin dito the headlight, the stylish and efficient headlights that offer optimal visibility in various driving conditions. And uh, meron din tayo nakikita dito ang daytime running light. And dito sa front fascia, parang di, mayroon dito ang combination of chrome accent and yung dynamic shield na uh, which gives uh, aggressive look yung uh, cutting dito sa front fascia. And yung DRL also located uh, on the side of the bumper. So very sporty na din yung uh, face ni Toyota Wigo as compared to the previous model so on the side dito sa rim naka hub cap tapos bridge tone yung uh, gulong so yung size po pala ng rim is uh, size 14 so hindi pa siya naka ano guys naka mags dito sa side mirror naka body color and yung handle naka body color din and uh, dito sa likod yung stopping force is uh, naka drum brake then yung antenna yung traditional antenna and parang may matte black finish dito na cutting or design and ito lang yung hindi ko nagustuhan guys actually or honestly yung uh, design dito sa taillight no? so para sa akin para siyang Kia Pride yung old model ng Kia Pride no? depende pa rin yun no? it's my own perspective so we have here the Wigo emblem and dito sa likod yung cutting is uh, consistent naman doon sa design sa front fascia In terms naman of suspension, it has a Mac person strut with coil spring for the front and semi-independent torsion axle beam with coil spring for the rear suspensions, respectively. So, dito tayo sa cabin. So, this is actually the base model of Wigo naka fabric parang may accent dito na red and gray sa mga seats and very basic yung ano yung uh, component dito or yung mga materials merong combination of hard plastic dito sa uh, dito sa side and uh, dito sa armrest pero naka all power na yung mga windows guys and then dito matte black merong lagay ng gamit may maliit na cup holder may yung speaker so dito sa steering wheel walang controls so hindi na yung naka leather up yung uh, steering wheel meron na siyang traction control tapos uh, nakikita natin dito yung air vents on this side and uh, actually nagustuhan ko din yung ano parang yung design dito sa sa dashboard so for me it's uh, actually consistent 
no doon sa outer design no very sporty and futuristic na din pero in terms of the infotainment it has a one din or a single stereo yung uh, infotainment dito meron tayong nakikita ditong uh, socket dito lagay ng gamit may dalawang uh, maliit na cup holders and uh, manual transmission shifter yung lever ng uh, handbrake naka manual and meron ditong maliit na lagay ng uh, gamit The Toyota Wigo is currently constructed using the Daihatsu New Global Architecture or the DNGAA uh, platform. The J, the E, and the top of the line G are the three Wigo hatchback models available. Toyota is bringing back a CVT for the 2024 model which replaces the outdated 4-speed automatic. So dito sa second row, pasok tayo. For the dashboard perspective, yun din yung nagustuhan ko, uh, yung dashboard. Medyo maganda siyang uh, yung cutting which is consistent sa outer design. No? And you can actually change naman or upgrade the infotainment aftermarket. So dito sa likod, uh, napapansin ko din na okay din naman yung legroom. No? Though hindi talaga ganun kalaki or yung spacious kasi of course this is a hatchback uh, Uh, model, no? So, okay din naman yung legroom. Because uh, I'm only 5'4". Wala lang handle dito sa sa, uh, sa gilid. Which is, uh, supposedly, meron sana. For safety, no? For safety reasons. Eh, wala din tayo nakikita dito yung center console. And, uh, walang packet dito sa likod ng, uh, upuan both sa passenger at saka sa driver in terms of safety it has uh, driver's airbag the front passenger's airbag meron na din itong EBD or the electronic brake distribution the ABS or the anti-lock brake system with uh, EBD the immobilizer stability control electronic door locks and isofix So again, magdepende yan sa sa variant no of this Wigo. Not all those mentioned nandito sa manual transmission. Some of those are mentioned uh, are present no pala in the higher trim levels. So power steering na din, power windows and uh meron na din siyang hill start assist no for the higher trim levels. All right for me Uh, this is the most practical no? um, for the, especially for those uh, magkakaroon ng mga first car and you are fan of having a manual transmission kasi medyo magaan lang din naman yung clutch nito and yung handling ng steering wheel alright so I hope nagustuhan ninyo yung nakita ninyo and uh, maybe you will consider this uh, small vehicle as your first car or even your second car Thank you guys for watching. Bye and God bless.